the difference is between you and me? I make this look good. What up, Falcons Nation? Rise Up Nation. It's your boy, Jazzy Jeff. Real talk, no gimmicks. Bring that real Falcons talk to real Falcons fans. And a special thanks to my 600 plus subscribers. I appreciate the love. Now let's get back into this video. I wanted to show you clips today of the difference Jeff Albrick and Raheem Morris have made since taking over the play calling duties. First, I'm going to show you how we used to play in a clip from week seven versus the Rams. And then I'm going to show you a clip from last week and how we played against the Carolina Panthers. Now first, hit that subscribe button so you can get future content. Now versus the LA Rams. As you can see, we're going to rush four. Jared Goff is going to notice that there's a void in the zone because we're playing a shell coverage and Falcons are playing the sticks. So when he drops back, it's an easy pitch and catch to Brandon Cooks. And by the time Ricardo Allen notices the play, it's too late because he's too far back. So Brandon Cooks gets an easy first down on a first down. First and 10 gets the first down. Now, I'm going to show you a play versus the Panthers. We're going to act like we're rushing for this time, but we're going to drop back Jack Crawford into coverage. Now, that confuses uh, Kyle Allen, and he wants to throw to DJ Moore, but he sees there's a bracket coverage now. Jack Crawford's underneath, Devondre Campbell's on top. So even though DJ Moore makes this catch, there's nowhere to go, and he cannot get to the first down because there's this bracket coverage. We still played a zone defense, but we closed in with the guy underneath. Perfect defense. Now, versus the Saints, I'm actually going to give Vic Beasley some love here. Now, when we rush on this play, you'll notice Tap McKinley takes up a double team. Vic Beasley's smart enough to twist back inside. The center tries to pick up Vic Beasley, but he realizes too late that it opened up a lane for Adrian Claiborne. Adrian Claiborne rushes right up the middle, takes down Drew Brees, and Vic Beasley comes back to help him finish it off. That is excellent play recognition by Vic Beasley. This is something I did not see before Jeff Albrick and Raheem Morris took over the play calling duties. Excellent play on defense. A different scheme and the adaptability to change mid play. Excellent play. Now this play has Raheem Morris written all over it on third down. It looks like Deion Jones is gonna be blitzing, but actually Deion Jones drops back in coverage. And you know who comes off the blitz? A, a delayed corner blitz by Isaiah Oliver on the right side. Look at this. This is perfect defense mixing it up disguising the play drew Brees has no idea isaiah oliver is coming he thought isaiah oliver was going to be in coverage still when he turned his back on his second read and by the time he turns around it's too much pressure drew Brees has no choice but to throw it away we get off the field on third and five a crucial third and five in the fourth quarter with five minutes left Excellent defense and creative play calling from Jeff Albrick and Raheem Morris that has this Atlanta Falcons defense playing inspired football once again. This has been Jazzy Jeff Real Talk. I hope you enjoyed my video. Please comment, like, share, subscribe. And as always, Falcons Nation, we rise up. Peace, y'all.